Now, Nashville police are trying to unravel the motive behind another movie theater shooting. A man with a hatchet and pepper spray eventually shot dead in front of frightened moviegoers. ABC Action News reporter Cameron Pollum is following the investigation for us tonight. Cameron. Right now, police say this is the man responsible. His name is Vincente Montano. Early reports said the shooter was a 50-year-old man. We've corrected that at this point, and now we're discovering some disturbing information about this suspect's past. Now, this was the chaotic scene this afternoon outside the Carmike Hickory 8 Theater near Nashville. According to Nashville PD, Montano, the suspect, has a history with mental illness. A background check revealed he was committed on four different occasions, twice in 2004 and twice again in 2007. That same report showing Montano was also arrested for assault and resisting arrest back in 2004 as well. Now, these, these psychiatric issues arising after he attacked a moviegoer earlier today during during a screening of Mad Max. Now, initial reports said he had a hatchet, a handgun, which turned out to be an airsoft pistol, and pepper spray. Now, one of those victims who was pepper sprayed along with his daughter thanked those who came to their aid. And I'd also like to thank all of the citizens who gathered around us, helped my daughter when we were pepper sprayed. Uh, that kind of gives me a little bit more faith in humanity again. Yeah, you can hear in his voice, he's obviously still a little shaken up from that. Now, that victim, who we only know as Steven at this point, also suffered a small cut from the suspect's hatchet. Eight people were inside the theater at the time. Fortunately, no one else was injured. In the studio tonight, I'm Cameron Polam, ABC Action News.